Hello, Americans. I'm other friends and subscribers around the world. Back again. Down here working in the... Someday it'll be the Eden. It's, uh... Freaking... Being hot this morning. So I'll try to get down here as the shades, uh... Still here. Get some stuff done and... All that. Um... Gardens are going good. Starting to get tomatoes and the cucumbers and all that stuff is growing good. Um, so I better do a check in. This uh, um, this video. If I end up cussing or something in this video, uh, I'm sorry, but with all this, uh, I try to keep the politics and you know all that kind of stuff out of out of my videos. You know, my grandpa was raised that uh, the two things that never talk about in business, which is really isn't business, but um, it's politics and religion. So I didn't, usually I just, you know, keep that stuff to kind of my myself because it's really nobody's business. But uh, everything that's going on, and especially when you start messing with the Dukes of Hazard, man. But that's the rebel flag thing. I think it's, uh, you know, man, total horseshit. Because, uh, especially to take it off the Dukes of Hazzard and all that, I grew up on that, man. It's a, you know, it's one of my all-time favorite shows. You know, you can do the Southern, you know, say that it's a bunch of, um, bigots and, uh, prejudiced and all that. But I'll tell you what, man, I am complete, I am not prejudiced at all. I don't give a shit if you're black, white, purple, or green. If you're an asshole, you're an asshole. And... You know, all this, you know, the, you know, the rebel flag above the state house, man, that's, you know, it don't give a two, two hoots in Haiti to me about that. But, uh, it is a part of our American history. And if you actually read into it, the rebel flag, you know, I mean, I'm up here in Yankee world, man. I was born and raised in Idaho. We weren't even a flipping state at the time. But I have lots of southern family, you know, I'm part Cajun and all that, so I have lots of that. But, <clears throat> I just, uh... I'm so sick of hearing about it. And then taking off a flipping good feeling, you know, TV show type family oriented man. It's right there with the Waltons and the, you know, the good feeling, all this crap that you see on TV, which leads me to another. I'm doing rants today. This stuff is just irritating the shit out of me. But another uh, um, one. Dude, I am so sick. I don't care, man, you know. I believe that there was Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. But hey, man, I have a couple. Uh, man, one of my, I love the guy, you know, and he's gay, and that's, you know, that's his thing, man, you know. But I also, as a freaking uh, human, should have my rights and for my own beliefs and stuff. And every time I turn my freaking TV, I'm seeing two guys in daytime TV when my little baby, grandbaby's going to be watching TV. I turned it on the other day on Days of Our Lives, and there's two guys smooching with no shirts on laying in bed. That's bull, man. You know, that is, they don't even hardly do that crap with a man and woman. So uh, two guys, that's horseshit. And then last night, I'm watching PBS, you know, Channel 4, man, PBS, Public Broadcasting System. Um, Miss Kitty and I are sitting there watching this awesome show on, uh, uh, you know, where we came from and all that, which leads back to the, you know, the black and whites and all that. But uh, we all are the same. We're humans. We're mm -hmm. all, man, we all come from the same exact mm -hmm. places. And actually, in that show last night, um, the color of your skin, which it never has mattered to me anyway, your color of your skin means nothing. We actually have 4% was Neanderthal in us, yeah. too, that they've uh, determined with um, all the fancy Genetic sons. yeah, DNA and stuff. But, uh, but the gay thing, like I said, man, you know, I don't, I really don't care what you... You know, hey man, you know, you're going to run off with this dude and I'm going to go fishing. Hey man, me and Miss Kitty are going to go do our thing. I ain't putting it in your face. You know, that's, I just, I don't believe in it, but I don't, you know, if that's your thing, do it. But, um, this thing last night, oh, anyway, we were watching the PBS, watching this awesome science show, and then this next thing comes on, and all of a sudden it is, uh, six and seven and eight year old, uh, um, gen what was it, gender? Yeah, where they were getting, um, blocks on their 
um, estrogen and testosterone. Yeah, you know, turning them being transgender, transgender and stuff. Is six and seven years old, they're doing it. Dude, they're doing it because it's hip right now. Yeah. You know, and that's a uh, that's horse crap, man. That's oh, it just irritates. These kids don't know have a clue. You know, and yeah, maybe there is. You know, I've known people that, I mean. You know, going to school and people I know and, man, friends of mine. So don't think I'm some freaking, uh, what do they call them? Uh, Bashers. You no, know, the um, homophobia oh. or whatever the hell it is. Because, like I said, I don't care. As long as you ain't freaking messing with me or, you know. Or, we ain't messing with you. Yeah, I ain't messing with you, man. But I have as much right as a freaking uh, married freaking like women white guy to turn on my TV and not see that crap as you do to go fly your freaking rainbow flag down at the state house. It's a bunch of crap, man. And it's all hip. You know, that's the whole damn, the whole thing on that whole deal is just because it's a freaking hip thing. It's the only reason Obama got elected is because it was the end thing. Now look where the hell we're at. We've never had so much racial bullshit mm -hmm. until they put freaking Obama, who's not even a freaking pure, you know, whatever you want to call black man. He's half white. So, gosh, dang, I'm telling you, man, I had to rant, and I usually don't, like I said, I don't do it, Miss Kitty's laughing me yeah. out of the camera, it just irritates the crap out of me. You know, I sit down here working and stuff, and I'm just like, wow. And I'll tell you what, if you want to get into politics, if we get Hillary in that office, we are screwed. This freaking country is done, if we survive the rest of Obama's term. Because mm -hmm. he, and dude, I'm no Republican, because I don't freaking like Je uh, Jeb Bush. You know, he's kind of funny to watch on freaking talk shows and stuff, but he don't need to be running our country. Dude, I am an American, and a freaking, uh, I believe in the Constitution of the United States of America. I'm not a Republican. I'm not a Democrat. Uh, I put down one time I was a Constitutionalist, and then freaking now there's some group, this Constitutionalist thing, freaking, holy crap, man. Dude, I'm a freaking American, and I believe in the Constitution of the United States, and this freaking country is going down the hole. And if we don't pull together, we the people, pull together and get our heads out of our asses, they're going to take it over. I mean, they've already taken it over, but they're, dude, it's just, I can't even, you know. Man, I had to, I just had to freaking rant. Like I said, I usually don't, these have nothing to do usually with politics and all that. But, dude, I am so sick of it. And then Facebook and, uh, you know, they're, they're banning the freaking one company's banning the, um, Dukes of Hazard toys and TV lands taking the Dukes of Hazard off of freaking, uh, um, oh, off of the freaking TV ain't gonna play Dukes of Hazard and all this stuff no more. Holy crap, man. You know, next, you know, on the black or the white guy side, now they're gonna take Sanford and Son off probably because that's freaking, there's some prejudice stuff in there. And you better not put all in family on there, man, because that's freaking, you know, some serious crap. It's horse shit. Man, and I am so. Tired of all this smoke crap. screen? Yeah, and then it's people wonder why screen. I moved the hell out here, but I still hear the bullshit. Yeah. I guess I need to go farther. But man, I'm just I'm so tired of the you know, the racism and all the stuff, man, and they oh good night. It has never been so bad for ever, man. Not till freaking just man, it's just getting worse and worse and worse and, you know, man the that uh, guy going in that church and stuff down there, that is horrible, man. My thoughts and prayers are with those people. And you don't even hear about them now. Now all you hear about is the damn rebel flag. Who gives a shit? Man, dude, that freaking, you know, hang that little punk, but Jiminy Christmas, man. Anyway, you're not, you know, freaking this irritated you. I don't know, too bad. But, uh... Up here. Anyway, man, the freaking fire season's freaking getting horrible. Uh, me and Miss Kitty's 25th anniversary is Saturday. Uh, oh, and then we had the big porcupine race up there in Council. There's going to be a porcupine race, you know. So that's a world championship porcupine race. It's probably the only one in the world, but it's pretty fun to watch. And everybody's out. Running around middle of the night chasing porcupines right now, catching them with a broom and a trash can. So that's the some of the good all American stuff and you can go catch a porcupine whether you're black, white, purple, or green, it don't matter. It's horseshit. Or some what else was I gonna rant on? Rant on, man, that's just I'm so flippin' tired of it. Man, everybody needs to get their heads out of their asses.
You know, man? Crap. You know, concentrate on the freaking saving the earth and go plant a freaking garden. You know, instead, let's go freaking stand at the Capitol. We need to throw all them sons of bitches out of those, uh, you know, dude, we need to do away with the whole freaking federal government completely and start from scratch is probably the best damn thing to do. Man, they're all a bunch of flipping idiots. Gosh, damn. I don't freaking hate usually, but I'm getting to where I really hate them. <laughs> but, I mean, sorry, Miss Kitty, strongly dislike them. <laughs> on the other one, on eBay. Freaking eBay sucks. Man, I put a damn. <laughs> you laughing? remembered? <laughs> yeah, I remembered the other thing. Freaking eBay. Yesterday, you know, man, I've got a World War II clip for a freaking Colt 45, freaking 1911 A1. You know, 1945, and man, there's a hundred of the clips on there. They freaking, I get this notice from some yuppie guy, probably not even in my country, and they shut my account down and shut me down for three days because, uh, because I forgot to put the freaking, um, only takes seven rounds. It's such a bunch of crap. Freaking eBay is just as bad as the federal government. So, I think I'm done ranting for today. Feel better? Now that I've been it, yeah. yeah. I think I'll have a cup of cigarette, or a cup of cigarette, <laughs> cup of coffee. And if I uh, still drink, I'd have a beer, but I don't, so stick with the coffee. So anyway, that's my, uh, you know, and if you're just as disgusted with this country as I am, you know, man, I'm just one dude, but man, we all need to pull together and do something. I don't know exactly what, you know. And then anytime you try to do anything, man, it'll either kill you secretly or you'll just disappear. You know, but man, you need to get a lot of people together and take back our damn country. All right, man. Happy Fourth of July to everybody. <laughs> All right, bye.